This is Brad the Kitchen Guy with one of my super secret kitchen hacks. It's called pre-cooking your flour. Have you ever gotten that wonderful plate of country fried steak with gravy and when you get done your belly feels like it's going to bust? Well that's because they didn't cook the flour first or it didn't spend long enough in the pan. Now. One of the things you can do is you pre-cook your flour and that people are gonna go, what do you mean? Well, in order to get that pasty taste out of that flour, not to bust your belly, flour actually gets cooked. It gets cooked in the roux with the fat in the pan and you gotta keep doing this for about 15, 20 minutes to make sure that it don't have no lumps and it's all nice and smooth and creamy. Or you can do a kitchen hack like I do. We're gonna take the flour and we put it in the oven at 400 degrees in about 20 minutes. It's going to be a beautiful golden brown and nutty flavor. And you just drop it in that fat, stir it, and it's done. And you won't get that belly busting moment. So all you do, take a pan, put your flour in, and like everything else in cooking, even it out so it cooks evenly. You don't want it too thick. And there she goes. In 20 minutes, this is gonna be golden brown. You put it in your cabinet, it never goes bad because when you cook it, it takes all the moisture out. And you can use it, a couple of teaspoons, and you can have an instant gravy just like that. Brad the Kitchen Guy, see you in a few. All right, we're back here. Due to the magic of YouTube, you all missed that 20 minutes of the flour cooking in the oven. Now I want you to look at this. This has been in that oven for about 20 minutes. See how it's that nice yellow color? It went in looking like this. Can you, can you see the difference there? Now, your cooked flour is absolutely perfect for making your gravy and your bechamel sauce. This will stay in your cabinet forever, just like salt does, just like sugar does. Why? It's anhydrous. That means it ain't got no moisture in it. You just take it, put in a little plastic jar, put it up in your cabinet. Anytime you want to make a gravy, melt down your oil or your fat, throw a little bit in, stir it up, it's done in seconds and it doesn't clump and you don't have to be there stirring it all the time. This is quick, fast, easy. Flour makes the color. And when it turns color, it's cooked and done. Now, Take your flour, throw it in the oven, 350 degrees, 20 minutes, a little more, a little less. You'll know, it'll turn color. Best hack you got today for me, Brad the Kitchen Guy. Remember to like, subscribe, and share, and tell me what you want to see next. Thank you.